the last word on Newsday Live is perspective. It's all about where you sit. And a new IMAX film gives you the best seat in the house for an up-close and personal view at Ocean's Greatest Creatures. NECN's Brad Puffer live at the New England Aquarium in Boston where this film is making its world premiere. Brad? Well, that's right, Beth, and this really is a perfect marriage here at the New England Aquarium. After all, thousands of people head out every summer on whale watches from here, and now they have the chance to go see an IMAX film to see these creatures underwater and in 3D. The mother will gently nudge her baby to the surface to breathe. This rare underwater video of a mother humpback whale and her calf is just one scene in the new 3D IMAX film, Dolphins and Whales. You just can't help yourself. You have to reach out and try to pet them and, you know. Oh, Actress and environmentalist Daryl Hannah narrates the film, which made its world premiere Wednesday at the New England Aquarium. She believes the audience will feel a strong connection to these incredible marine mammals. They have a lot of uh, uh, qualities that we can empathize with and have compassion for. And um, they're also just magnificent. You know, they're so exquisitely beautiful. Capturing these scenes took the film team three years, diving all over the world, often without oxygen tanks, which allowed the divers to approach as closely as possible. It's 600 hours underwater to get 45 minutes on the screen. The patience to be there at the right time, at the right moment, all of this was shot in the wild. Jean-Michel Cousteau yeah, is the film's it, yeah. presenter. He says many of the 12 species captured here, including the manatee, are on the edge of extinction. It's an underlying message of the film. They're very, very close to us. and. If they don't do well, we're not doing well either. Looking into the eye of a whale is said to be like looking into the window of one's soul. Dolphins and Whales makes its world premiere tonight, but it will open to the public on Friday and likely play here at the New England Aquarium throughout the year. In Boston, Brad Puffer, NECN. Beth, back to you. Well, the visuals in this are just stunning, and I hear that you got a chance to see the movie. What'd you think? I did, and you know, looking at it in 2D on a flat screen really doesn't do it justice because you have to see it in 3D to get the full experience. You really are amazed at how close these videographers, these divers got to these wild humpback whales, and the pictures they bring back are quite incredible, Beth. Yeah, now we can get close too. Brad Puffer, thanks.